I'd like to ask my husband, Brother Gross, to come forth and bring the Word of God to you. It's going to build you up and give you a hurry tense. Praise God. Brother Gross. All right. Amen. Praise God. Good word, good music. Praise God this morning. Let's give glory to God. Amen. And we definitely are a child of the King. Praise God. Glad to be here this morning. Again, it's our privilege to, to share the word of the Lord with you. Praise God. Privilege it is. Amen. So God bless you. Those of you viewing, those of you listening by radio, we're ever mindful of you. <laughs> ever mindful of you. Praise God. We, we're here for you. We want to bless you. We want to help you. And in all reality, it'll be the Lord wanting to help you. So we're ever mindful of you. Praise God. Glory to God. And God's working. I said God is working. Yes, he sure is. And he'll, I know he's dealing with people. He sure is. Amen. He is. He's doing it today. Mm -hmm. And you may be one, and I hope you are. Because... <laughs> I want you to know something that I don't care what you're doing. You now listen. These programs are played sometimes three thirty in the morning and six thirty early in the morning and eleven at night and on the radio and four o'clock of the day and eleven a.m. of the morning on radio. And look, whenever you may be hearing this, God loves you. Praise God, He loves you. He cares about you. That's why we're here. You're why we're here. <laughs> Amen. But it's because God loves you, and I want you to know it. My heart goes out to you. Praise God. Because I know there's hurting people. There's hurting people that God loves. He really does. And He don't want you hurting. He wants you well. He wants to be Lord of your life. He'll bring peace to you. He'll bring comfort to you. He'll bring life, and, and if you'll receive him, you can have life. Amen. Amen. And everything that comes from Jesus to you and from God in his word will be life to you. Life. It'll bring some sort of life in some sort of way that will add to you. So that's what he's trying to do. My heart goes to you. I'm ever mindful of you. Praise God. So when we talk about God's word, it's for you. When we say something that Jesus said, it's for you. Amen. And sometimes we say hard things. Hey, hard things need to be said. Praise God. People believe in lots of things, lots of goofy things, things that's not even in line with God's word. Hey, they need to be brought to light. That's not God. It's not his word. It's not his way. So as a real minister of Jesus and a real minister of God's word, we... we we find it needful and necessary and by the Holy Spirit to say those things. Praise God. Some people say, well, you know, I don't understand why you say some of those things. You know, they seem hard. They seem hurtful sometimes. Look, I can't help it. It's what God says. God's Word is so. We want to stay on the right path. We want you on the right path. That's why we're here. We know our purpose this morning, today, whenever you may be hearing this. We know our purpose. And that's to say... What God says in His Word, to get the, dig down and get the real truth of what God has said in His Word, and He can give it to you. Amen. And not some junk. We don't need that. We've had too much of it. Church junk is what it is. You know, in our house, we have a garbage can, and what's in there? Garbage. We take the garbage and throw it in the garbage can. That's what it's there for. But we don't get the garbage out and put it all over the house and say, boy, look at all the garbage we have. No, that's, that's garbage. It goes in the garbage can. And we take it out and it goes out in the trash. It goes to the dump. Well... A lot of this stuff people hear is nothing more than church trash, church junk. Junk that needs to be discarded, put in the garbage can, discarded. Well, amen. Now, let's turn our Bibles open to Matthew this morning. Matthew, the 
first chapter. I want to read something to you. Praise God. Father, thank you this morning. In the name of Jesus, thank you for your word. Again, I pray for every person that's listening and viewing. Every person, every person. I say, Lord, bless me. Help us all. Help us to hear your word. Help us to understand your word. I pray for wisdom. I pray for wisdom for these that will be listening. The spirit of wisdom and the revelation and the knowledge of you coming so we can hear and receive the real truth of your word. Pray it over every person today in Jesus' name. And I plead the blood over them. Praise God. I thank you for saving them. I thank you for saving them. Blessing them. Praise God. In Jesus' precious name. And the word they need to hear, may it come to them. May they hear it and receive it. Be free. And be free. Praise God. We ask it in the mighty name of Jesus. And we believe you for it. Amen. Amen. 